Welcome to RIA Uprising. I am your host, Vicky Cloud. We are sold out. As we grace you in Colorado Springs, Colorado. The Rockies might be a clusterfuck, but I promise you this show will not be. Oh boy, oh boy. We got Trey Miguel, Lance Romance. Here we go, baby. Oh, big palm strike. It's a midsection jab. Another one. You know. Lance Romance, former tag team champions with Kid. To throw head scissors. Uh, Kid's been hanging out with Trey Miguel as well as the MSK. Oh, catches it. Punches him right in the face. Oh, insult to injury. Injury to insult. Lance has a lot of aggression to let out. He definitely does not like Trey Miguel hanging out with his little buddy. And uh, Kid refused to be the special guest referee for this match. Oh, jabs. Watch those feet. Boom! Oh, and Trey's busted open. And another head scissors by Trey Miguel. Big clothesline by Lance. Oh, muscle him up. Ram slam. With the chop block. Oh. Indian death lock. One. Got him again. Oh, frame of hell. Taking it to Lance Romance. Oh, Anderson! What a this big distraction. Trey wants him some Anderson, and Anderson has a match later on tonight. Oh, just walking away. But Lance, Lance, he's off to, he's off to Trey. He just now sees the last romance is right behind him. Lance ducks. Spinning back fist. Jab by Lance. Punch him in the face. Oh, we're definitely not making it back in the ring in time. I can say that much. Wait, maybe? We're at seven. Eight. Oh, Eight. Trey, just take the count out, buddy. Nine. And Trey takes the count out! <laughs> oh, poor Lynch.
And there's the bell. Oh, man for me. Donnie get from the white. Big form by Andrade. Side headlock. Oh, gets the wrist control. Will he trip over Toro? No, Corvo. Reverses side headlock of his own. Andrade shoves him off the ropes. And no short tackle. Meets him with a punch. Corvo rolls right out. Evading danger. Burrow coming around by Andrade. Did not take long to play to this crowd. Andrade. Oh. Hey. Oh, come on, boy. Taking it right to Andrade. Usually you see Andrade as an aggressor, but uh, this is different. Corvo. Wants to make a statement. And he's shown tons of flashes of brilliance, but uh, just never really connect. Oh, right into an arm drag, Lucha Libre style. Comes back with a spinning drop kick. That's not sleep on Corvo Brown. That's super. Power of Andrade! Ooh, drive him by the face, slap him down. Good a Charlie Murphy, a uh, big James moment there. Andrade playing back to this crowd. In quite a few jeers. Ooh, using the rope. Play with a slingshot. That would definitely take the, the wind out of yourselves. Oh, now he's boxing with forearms. Snap there. Off the rope. Drop kick to the head. Pinpoint decision by Andrade. And then he just lays him out with a boot in a gin. Haunting his way. Oh, big form. DT oh, just hangs him. What a DDT. And again, that big boot. Catching Corvo right in the face, in the eye. On drag back Corvo. That liner. End of the days. Into the cover. One, two. Andrade kicks out. Oh, Corvo's not done. And again. Back into the cover. One, two, and again. Oh, evading. Knee lift. Kick. Switch the leg! Oh, punch him in the face, punch him in the face. Another suplex.
Another flatliner. Into the cover. One. Two. Only two count. What a match this has been. Talk about taking someone's face off. My god. And that is it. You're one at Corvo Brown. Might be the best super kick I've seen in quite some time. A sign of respect. Yeah, I love to see it. And coming up next, we have tag team action as Dangerous Rivers, Leon London with Scotty Rush in their corner. More phenomenal takes on a newly formed team, a debuting Sheamus and a Bizzle Austin Blake. They just want violence, and I believe they call themselves the Red Army. How will these rooks face off against more phenomenal? We know Leon London and Austin Blake know each other very well. Former tag team. Best friends. But uh, both went their own separate ways. Austin Blake fighting success as the Gold Rush Junior Heavyweight Champion. Leon London. Flashes of brilliance as a signals wrestler. And as a tag team wrestler not capturing gold. Russ Rivers is the number one contender to Austin Blake's. Gold Rush Junior Heavyweight Championship, so it's the first time these two are scoring off in a ring in quite some time. They did have a singles match before. Very fun. Russ Rivers getting the win there, so I'm quite intrigued to see what happens in this tag team bout. And, uh... A debut of Sheamus! Red Army looking like a well, nice looking team. Neon London actually uh, overpowering Sheamus. Didn't think I would say that. And get a clean break. Side headlock by uh, Neon. Take Sheamus down. Sheamus quickly just out muscles him there. Kick to the Celtic Warriors head. And uh they didn't get a one count. Oh Seamus putting the boots to him. Big brawler that he is. Just hangs him up. Scotty Rush felt that one. Oh boy. Power slam. Famous guy won numerous titles over his career. And I, I'm glad to be able to get him on board. Oh boy. Follow up slam. And if anything, Austin Blake has some muscles. That's a muscle in this game. Oh, big distance form by Leon. Rocking Sheamus. Oh, got him again. Watch out for that Pele kick. Standing shooting star press. Last time we saw more phenomenal. They were losing to the Olympic heroes. That was a hell of a fight. You know that left a bad taste in their mouth. Oh, no. Uh, we're gonna get a tag, but no, Seamus went for the cover. Only a one count. And here comes Austin Blake. Scoring off with his uh former best friend. 
Down slice on the back. Oops, I'm over right into a power bomb. And Russ tags him in. This is what we need to see. Champion and contender battling it out. But no, Austin. He's tagging in Sheamus. Mind games, maybe. Oh, double axe and right to the face of Russ. Got rich. Power bomb by Sheamus. Making himself quite useful. Oh, back suplex. German. Watch out for the vertical. Spins him around. There it is. Breast Rivers. Suplex guy. Sheamus. Punch you in the face guy. To the cover. And you know Austin would love for James to just soften Rest Rivers up before the pay per view. It's some weeks away, but you know. Certain things can linger on for some time. Oh, might be time to hold his nuggets. Into the cover. One, two. Oh, Mr. Me. Oh, tag team. Work. What do we got? Oh, boy. Perk around right to a power bomb. Into the cover. One, two. Oh, Shane's gonna have to make a tag. I mean, he can take a lot of damage, but man, he's more on their game. Oh, one for the cutter. Oh, by Sheamus. Belly to belly. Some of you may be wondering how did uh, Seamus and Austin Blake come up with the turn with Army? Well, Seamus' hair is red. Austin Blake is a Dragon Ball Z fan, plays on the Red Ribbon Army, and that's what you got. And here comes Austin, here comes Russ. Kuma stop turning Russ Rivers inside out. Oh, looks like Austin's going for a ride now. A little bit of a vert suplex for you too, buddy. Oh, about to spike him with a hurricane rana. Head first. Into the cover. One. Only one count. Oh, close into the back of his noggin. What's he gonna do? I'm quite curious. Oh! Modified Cloverleaf! Taking out the knees and the legs with the high fly, not a bad idea. Northern Lights, no bridge. Never, never, never. Oh, send him up! Six stone! And he's. He's on Rust Rivers here. Oh, deadlift. Gut wrench. Suplex, yeah. Oh, setting him up with something. Oh, the Dragon Ball Z suplex. 
One, two. Dragon Ball Suplex? Whatever it is, it works. Big drop kick to the back of his head. And now, getting Zen. You think he's feeling himself? Oh, pointing that right at Leon London. He's still just admiring his handiwork. Oh, I think he wants Leon. Oh, Will Barrow. Bulldog. And uh, get Leon is what he got. And Leon will run to the cover. One. Oh, more than lights. Float over. Might be time for some London Bridge 2.0, folks. There it is. It was lost in the way. Into the cover. One, two. Oh, awesome too. Has a million lights. Nothing fancy about it. Drop salt. And look at Leon cutting off the ring. Awesome slice on the back. Punches Leon in the back. Leon punches him in the face. European uppercut. Oh, this is a super kick. Awesome with some kick strikes. Oh, deadlift. Right into a power bomb. Leon's back up. Oh, Shadow Realm. In through the cover. One, two. Leon kicks out at two. Form. Awesome yet again. Dropping Leon London. Fucking unnecessary kick to the back. Oh, Kylo's going for that final flash. He stuffed off. Leon kicks him off. Arm drag by Austin. Punches him in the face. Oh, close lines him out. Oh, I think we're ready for takeoff, folks. Ace man plancha talk about high altitudes. Oh, roundhouse kick. Back elbow referee is at two. Shoulder first he goes. Scuba stomp to you. We're at four. I won't be surprised if either man gets counted out. This might get personal. We're at six. Seven. And seven. Bounce his head off. Eight. We're at eight. Big reminder, folks. Nine. Oh, yeah, mate. Oh, he broke the count. He has won via count out before. <laughs> I believe his debut match versus Dragon Wind. Here we are. Get to see. Oh, zigzag. We're at four. Austin's is going to break the count. We know he's rolling back out. We know it. Oh, one for another Goomba Stomp. This is it. Leon gets back in. Austin's back in. Here we go. Reset match. Olympic Slam. Oh, okay then. He's just being petty at that point. Roundhouse kick. Right into Spanish Fly. He's truly enjoying himself, I believe. 
this might be the run of his career. Busted Leon open. And might be time for the big bang attack. Into the cover. One, two, three. Oh, Russ just missed it. Famous was hurt. I don't think he will be able to get back in. But uh, Austin held his own for that last bit of the match. Momentum is in the champion's favor, that's for sure. Oh, that was so cool. What a win for the Red Army. And speaking of Dragon Wind, we have him in action. We haven't seen him in quite some time. This should be a treat. Going up against Tony Abs. Tony Nice. Always impressive. Always exciting. This should be fun. I said in the last match, we were ready for takeoff. We should most definitely be taking off. In this match, premier athlete Tony Nice, Dragon Winner, a skilled luchador. Let's go. Let's give our Gold Rush Junior Heavyweight Division some love. Oh, standing switch by Dragon Win. Oh, muscles Tony down. And Tony's usually one of the bigger uh, cruiserweights, junior heavyweights. Definitely the strongest. Snap, he plays by Tony, floats over, ran to the cover, with not even a one count. Oh, Aiden and Dragon win. Kicks in midsection, high knee live. Kicks the chest. Squeaks the leg. Oh. We're taking off. Is it time to take off? Yes, it is. Elbow drop. Even right into the corner. Nothing good. Nothing safe happens there. I can tell you that much. Bottom spinning hill kick. Oh, big knee. Oh, soft. Kick to the face. Spinning hill kick. Oh, right! And 
into the Michinoku driver. Take him right in the right in the face. Drop kick one. Oh, oh, wind them out. Wakely gets him back in the ring. Oh, sits it out. Oh, that bit of an Indian death lock. On some random midsection. Blue Kang style. Oh, big lariat. Line the spine. Oh, miss that. Oh, down with the pump handle. Into the cover. One, two. The knee pad is down! He just murdered this man! Into the cover! Running knees, one, two, three! Out in the abs! Dragon win dejected, but what a win for Tony Nice with the running niece. And coming up next in our co-main event, we have the cult leader. A wrestler of justice, if you will, the self-proclaimed chosen one, the self-proclaimed chosen one. From above. He likes to remind everyone to look up the meaning of his name. Gift of God, if you will. Mateo going one on one with the RIA Intercontinental Champion. Everyone's favorite pain in the sass. Kid, we seen his two best friends go to war earlier tonight. Trey Miguel, Lance Romance. Kid, not in the other one's corner. He he wiped his hands. What he wanted no part of it. He needed to focus on Mateo, who is always deadly. And you know he wants the spotlight. He he's gonna win him a title match if he can uh, knock off Kid. Starting off with a spinning back kick. Oh, it's got him up. Pump handle. Drops him right on his head. I would have held on. He's excited. Mateo not donning the mask today. Seeing that smug face of his. Pump handle right into the neck breaker. Kid does have a history of concussions. Comes back with a knee lift and uh, sassing the crowd, doing what he does best. 
Mateo is rocked. Oh, punch. Springboard by Mateo. Springboard course crew uppercut. Holy shit. That's how you get someone's attention. Oh, he's going right back to that. Drops him again on his head. He, he has a game plan here. Oh, talk about rocking someone. Take a bow, my guy. Oh, back elbow by Kid. These two have had a war of wards. Oh, double kick, kick to the face. Mateo comes back, Kid kicks him off. Oh, went for a corkscrew uppercut of himself, looking to unwind. Mateo sidestepped it. Kid. Kid's been on a run. Oh. Talk about your neck breakers. Oh. Takes him in the hammy. Oh. Nice fisherman. Oh, now he's gonna punch him in the face. Vicious streak by the kid. I was gonna dance in his face. Talk about a showman. Both guys are quite the showman in their own in their own way. The tail right into the cover. Failing from Pangea. Kid, a uh, resident. Oh, excuse me, nice bread of Las Vegas, Nevada. I think he tried to punch him on the way in. Tail spins him around. Off the rope. Oh, talk about walking into a super kick. I saw the one on Rade hit. Well, Corvo hit. It's crazy. Oh, vertical suplex into the power drive. We haven't seen that in a hot minute. One, two, no, even a two. Pulling out all the stops tonight, then. My God. Oh, he's looking to kill Kid. He's looking to kill him. You're dead. Wrapped him right in the face. Time up. Power bomb. Oh, trips him up. Slides Mateo back in. Mateo's back up. Relatively fast, might I add. Oh, is he gonna hang it up? Yes, he does. Hip toss neck breaker combination. You say what you want about Mateo. He's eccentric. He's weird. All this and that. The guy can go in the ring. I don't know where he trained, who trained him, but they trained him well. And Kid. Diving through like a torpedo. DDT. Oh, this is a drop kick. Arm drag. Oh. Threw Kid off and then just rammed his back into the apron. We're at five. I definitely do not want this to end in a count out. And it won't. Uh oh. Setting him up. No! What's for the lack of Mosa? Kid had it scouted. Bounces his head off the turnbuckle. Oh, might be time for the greatest thing since sliced bread. And 
into the cover. One, two, Mateo kicks out. Crucifix, I would have held on. Mateo's definitely killing it, I can tell you that. Shadouken! Arm drag! I believe that was a bangarang. <laughs> and now he's gonna have a breakdown. Punched him. Oh boy. And again. Going right back to that move. Every time he hits it, he's pretty excited about it. Both men wrestling style is very different. Kid, not really any formal training, backyard wrestler, but very skilled in the ring. Mateo, more of a, you know, your traditional wrestling pedigree. We're at seven. Unless something crazy happens, I'm going to need them to get back in the ring. Works the shooting star. We're at, we're at nine. We're at nine. Ten. Oh man, we're gonna have to run it back. That was fun. Man, that was fun. Switching gears. We're gonna end it on. With some tag team wrestling as we have the machine gun Carl Anderson. The big Luke Gallows going up against the followers of Mateo. Juggy Drax with the Mohawk. Juggy Vaughn. Oh boy, oh boy. This is going to be good. This is going to be hard hitting. This is going to hurt. It's going to hurt bad. Referee. Oh, you have some tension between uh, Anderson and uh, Gallo. So, and it's gonna start it off. This is a uh, Drax. And uh, walks right into this power bomb. That mare. Kick right into the back. Oh. Man, now he's gonna punch him in the face. Oh, besides that, dude, look at the quickness. Oh, GG Drax. And you know. Uh, well, first of all, they're already angry. Angry dudes. But, uh, I know Mateo told them to do work. After ending that great match with Kid in a draw, definitely gonna have to run that back. One, two. Well, I'm gonna say, man, she count out of that. Uh. Anderson hurt. Oh, super kick didn't even phase him. Just muscling Anderson, and we saw them taunting the uh, Adam Cole not too long ago. 
And uh, here comes Luke. Right here comes Drax. Here we go. Oh, wait for the boot. Bounce right off. Punch Luke in the face. Not too many times Luke goes for a boot and you don't go down. And I'm going to tell you that now. Even the clothesline. Oh, he said, I got something for y'all. How about Pump Panther? You're going down. You're going down. Oh, big loop. Loops up. Elbow drop. Right to the heart. Into the cover. One. Two. Oh. Drax used pet. It was effective. Here comes the big one, Vaughn. Oh, he took him down with the clothesline. I don't even know if he really got all of that, of that clothesline, to be honest with you. Oh. Let of justice turns him inside out. One. Only a one. Picks him off. And another lariat. Doesn't even get a one count on that. But that arm chat, Lariat, turning Luke Gallows inside out. Thing of beauty. Super kick doesn't even take him down. Shells him off. I tell you, these droogies are not human. Gallus refusing to make the tag. Look at that German just dropped him. He just threw him. No technique, just throw him. Oh boy, might be time for a baptism. Bye, fire. One, two. Oh, he kicked out. And Drax made Anderson pay as well. And a lariat. I truly do not want to be any team facing the followers of Mateo. I do not want to be the tag team champions right now. Oh, big neck breaker, and we know it's going to be the Syndicate taking on the Dark Martyrs. Oh, slapped him. Gut wrench. Power, but oh my goodness, gut wrench too much. Look how excited this man is. Just in good violence. Oh, one more time. Lord of Justice! Or should I say the Arm of Justice? Two. Alice kicks out again. Look at that arm. Look at the bars. Look at, look at this man. 6'9, 6'11, something like that. Snap by Luke oh he's got him by the throat can he get him up Shout slam I can't believe he got him up cover one two more it's just a one Overhead, belly to belly. I think Luke's gonna want to make that tag now. Vaughn's just fucking playing with him. And here comes Anderson. But how excited is he really getting the ring? Dropkick doesn't even take him down. DDT does. Super kick again. Snapmare. Oh, off the rope. There you go, big boy. One, two. The first two count for the Good Brothers. The first two count for the Bullet Club. Russian leg sweep. First, dare I say, visible signs of hurt. 
counters that DDT. Needless. Oh, backbreaker. Oh boy. Okay. Now I'm just gonna stump on him. Again, just flexing, flexing that muscle. Oh, he's got him up. TKO. To the cover. One, two. Vaughn. Vaughn gets out. Short DDT yet again. Spiking Vaughn. Bond's hurt. He's clearly hurt. Anderson cutting it off. Lands the drop kick. And an elbow. Now he's just gonna bang his head against the canvas. The good brothers have turned this around. Or may have turned it around. But then Bond. Big overhead though to belly. He's playing with him. But I think he should probably make a tag to Drax. Drax is very fresh. Oh boy. Might be time for another baptism by fire. One, two, three. Didn't even matter. Look at this arm of justice turned them inside out. And Drax. Drax playing keep away. Baptism by fire. How high he gets them up for that, my god. And a dead whoosh. Turn them inside out. It's just violence with these guys. Big choke slam. That could have been a turning point. Here are your winners. Tracks to the left. Vaughn to the right. Good luck. Well, folks. That's it for me. I'm Vicky Cloud. This has been Uprising. Good night and good.